Welcome back to Power Lunch. Just moments ago, Kroger announcing what it plans to do with all of that extra cash that it will get from the tax reform law. The supermarket chain just announcing several improved employee benefits. For instance, they're going to offer up to $3,500 in an annual stipend for continuing education, an educational leave of absence, also raising wages for store associates, and increasing its company's 401k match. Here to talk about that and a lot more in a Power Lunch exclusive, we've got Rod McMullen, the chairman and CEO of Kroger. Nice to see you again, Rodney. Great to talk to you, Sarah. So we've heard from a number of companies as to how they're going to use the extra money from tax reform, everything from one-time bonuses to buybacks and dividends. Why are you investing specifically in your employees' education? Well, for us, we really thought it was important to have a balanced approach. So the savings is about $400 million a year. So we're investing a third of that with our customers, a third with our associates, and a third for our shareholders. And when we looked at the investment in our associates, uh, what are the things that uh, we could help partner with our associates that would help somebody come here for a job and make it a career? And what we found uh, through our research is, obviously, today people are incredibly interested in education and continuing that education, but fearful of debt and other parts. So we thought it was really important to support that and support it in terms of, we'll help you get your GED, we'll help you uh, to learn English mm -hmm. as a second language, a college degree, MBA, whatever uh, works for you.